Xiaomi is a smart product and consumer electronics manufacturing company that primarily focuses on smartphones and smart hardware connected through IoT platforms. Xiaomi will launch its first electric vehicle, EV, on March 28, 2024, the Xiaomi SU7. The Xiaomi SU7 electric car is manufactured by BIK Group, a state-owned automotive company with a factory in Beijing. Xiaomi unveiled the SU7 at a technology conference in December last year. He said that the SU7 car was able to accelerate faster than Tesla and Paxton cars, faster than Tesla and Porsche EVs, with one capable of reaching 100 km per h in 2.78 seconds. One version of the SU7 car is capable of driving up to 800 km. The Xiaomi SU7 has a futuristic interior design with multiple physical buttons on the dashboard and a driver-centric interior. The dashboard has a floating design that integrates the HUD, flip instrument panel and air outlets. The SU7 also has low sitting position sports seats and a low dashboard. The Xiaomi SU7 adopts a floating dashboard design integrating the HUD, flip instrument panel and air outlets. Supposedly, this means the volume of the components is smaller, with the saved space being given over to the occupants. Remember those buttons mentioned earlier? Well, on the center console, there are four rocker switches plus the start-stop button. These control from top, temperature, fan strength, electric rear wing, and air suspension. Xiaomi Auto says that it believes that physical buttons are the most natural way for humans to interact with machines, and they are also the medium for establishing the emotional connection between people and vehicles. The rocker switches mean that they can be operated without being looked at with the controls being intuitive. However, the need for button for the electric rear wing seems questionable and even the one for air suspension is likely to only need occasional use. The performance version SU7 Max will be AWD equipped with dual motors with a maximum output of 495 kilowatts and 838 nanometers torque. The 0 to 100 kilometers per H acceleration is 2.78 seconds and the top speed is 265 km per h. The EV can also do 0 to 200 km per h in 10.67 seconds. The Kia TL's Kielin NMC battery has a capacity of 101 kWh and provides an 800 km CLTC range. The battery can recharge 390 km in 10 minutes, more than the Tesla Model S played. In 5 minutes, SU7 can add 220 kilometers, and in 15 minutes, 510 kilometers. According to Xiaomi, the SU7 is a pretty aerodynamic car with a drag coefficient of only 0.195 CD, the lowest among production vehicles. Lei Jun highlighted that the LiDAR, which sits on the top of the windshield, was inspired by the smooth design of a pebble. However, the model in the video showing the SU7 reaching 0.195 CD is the version without LiDAR. The SU7 sits on Xiaomi's Modena platform and is slightly longer than the Porsche Taycan. The dimensions are 4,997, 1,963, 1,455 mm in, L slash W slash H with a wheelbase of 3,000 mm. The car has a sizable 105-liter frunk and boot space with 517 liters. The SU7 was designed by the team around Li Tianyuan, Xiaomi's head of design, who joined the company from BMW, where he was responsible for the BMW i Vision Circular concept, BMW Niet, and the new 7 Series. The exterior designer is James Q, who joined Xiaomi from Mercedes-Benz, where he took care of Vision Equiquex design. Inside the car is a 16.1 central control screen with 3K resolution, a 7.1's instrument panel for the driver, and two screens in the rear for passengers, which are actually Xiaomi tablets called Mi Pads. 
Apple iPad is also compatible. Navigation can be screened on 56 HUD. The cockpit operation system HyperOS is powered by Qualcomm Snapdragon 8295. The automated driving system, ADAS Xiaomi Pilot, is powered by two NVIDIA Orin X chips with 508 tops computing power.